looking back on, on everything now, kind of what are your, what are your thoughts? I mean, I think just um, how special it's been to be a part of such a great group of girls um, and just playing for the best team in the world, you know, and I think um, it's an honor to be able to do that and to put your jersey on and the U.S. jersey and represent your country and not everybody gets the chance to do that. Not everybody gets the chance to end the way they want to end and um, I've had the rare opportunity to do that. We want to, we, I'm going out as a World Cup champion and going out on my own terms and it uh, feels pretty amazing. It's been a long time since the story in New York Times. You said, oh, I was thinking about quite a yep. long time ago. Are you glad you stuck it out? I'm so glad. You know, it's, it's funny because I'm getting a lot of those questions and it made me think about it and, and fate happened, you know. As, pretty much in the right spot, the right time, and I took advantage of it and uh, created the opportunity, and and here I am 12 years later or so. So, you know, I mean, it's just so cool to, to see that. I know for kids I can say that, hey, you know, your dreams can come true. You just keep working hard and uh, take the opportunities when they come. You know, at first I kind of forgot. I was like, oh, I got to get off the field fast. And then I was like, wait a second. This is the last time I get to do this. Slow down, you know. So um, I kind of slowed myself down and took it in and, and definitely thanked the crowd. And, you know, um, none of this could have happened with, without the fans in the U.S. And, um, you know, the, the game has grown so much. And you're seeing how many more fans are coming out to the U.S. game, the women's game. And um, that's just, a, a you know, our product is doing that. And we're doing that on the field. So it's been pretty cool.